So I took a little bit to process the fact that Bellamy is just alive and realized that Oda literally gaslit me for about 400 episodes into thinking he was dead. So at this point in One Piece, unless we have like an ace scenario where there is an entire like just donut as way too many of you say through someone's entire chest and I see the light like basically leave their eyes. I'm not counting anybody out anymore. I'm just not. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus and we're continuing Dress Rosa today and it has been an adventure non-stop and we're just getting started. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a sub and drop a fat like on this one if you haven't already and let's get into it. I like his design. Cavendish of the white horse. Everybody knows. 280 million. Not bad. Not bad. So does he have a white horse or is it just of the white horse? Oh my gosh. Bro, his ego about it too? Ew. Ew. Wait, what? Oh yeah, he's fighting for the devil fruit. Wait, how is he? How does he have such a high bounty? No devil fruit. He must be a strong fighter. Come here. Oh, he's got to take it all off. I mean, you can leave some of it on Luffy. Look at him. I want to see Cavendish fight, man. 280 million with no devil fruit. I think it's doable, but still impressive. He has to have hockey. No, leave on the cape of the helmet. It looks sick. Is he eating that flower? Oh, oh that's interesting. I mean, it helps with his disguise, too. Just say Lucy, bro! Oh my gosh, man. Oh, yeah. Dude, he for real can't be left alone. Everybody in there recognized his name. Everybody knows him. He's just eating the rose now. Or the real one's an eight meter tall giant. Funny how a rumor spread. Oh, so he don't like Luffy. Oh, he's been here for a minute. Oh, he does have a white horse. Everybody was talking about, about Luffy instead. Oh, no, he was famous and then Luffy stole all his fame. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Who, me? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> the slow just descent into darkness. Yeah, bro is literally just jealous that he took away his fame. His spotlight. New rookies one after another. I'm glad he has like not a petty reason to come after Luffy. I'm really glad. I mean, if he's already pretty strong and he gets the flare for her, he could be a real... <laughs> Luffy's already just forgotten about him. Luffy's attention span is just not there. Oh, somebody's listening. It's a big old boy. Gulp. I mean, we've been introduced to so many characters so quickly. Uh, it's going to take me a bit. Oh, here's another one with a focus. Mm. Oh my goodness. I just realized, yeah, seeing a woman. I, I haven't seen any other women in here. Oh, she's near Luffy. Sorry, Lucy. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, there's gonna be some, like, deep backstory, like, she's his daughter or something. Or, like, descendant. I don't know how long this statue's been here, or how old Kairos was. <laughs> Rebecca. Oh! Oh! God, no problem! He's kind of a dick! She looks up to him at the very least. Yeah. Strongest gladiator in the history of the Colosseum. 3,000 and zero? What a beast! A single slash from who? Who landed a hit on him? No one knows about him? I mean, isn't he long gone? It was forever ago? Kairos. I don't know if the wait what what they just take it for granted or take it for the, as the truth oh she's wearing like nothing it is a cool statue you can barely even see kairos's face oh, more cat calling undefeated girl oh so spartan's been a dick to her for a long time i feel like uh lucy and rebecca will team up now like in the arena Oh. Oh! Oh! Dang, bro! Yo, team up with us! 
Oh, they're not in the same block. Thank goodness. Good luck! Oh, she's so nice! Hmm. Interesting. So I, I should probably think about Kairos a little bit more in terms of the overall scheme of things. If it's that mysterious and that unknown about whether or not he actually existed and whatnot. I don't know. Who's rolling all these? Oh my gosh! It's the masked guy, yeah! Mr. Store, that's his name? Huh? What? Who? Dude, it's everybody trying to like 30v1 this one guy. Oh my gosh, bro! Movie is still trying- Lucy's still trying to jump. Okay, so you fall in the water, you just die. Happy store. Did he get that from a store called Happy Store? Like, bro! Is he- Did he win? I think he won. Is that block A done? Oh, shoot, we have our first winner. Dang. All right. Big ups, Happy Store. Impressive. <laughs> the, the bag, like, waving in the wind. Oh. Face reveal. Oh my gosh. This is huge. Oh. Who is it? They all know. Can I see? Even Luffy knows. Okay, dude, you can't be serious. Should I know? Who's like a big fella like that? Oh, Shue Jesus! No shot! Wait, is Blackbeard here then? Oh, dang. He was like a wrestler too. Oh my gosh, he's here? Freaking, uh, Bellamy is here, apparently? Ah. I guess I could have seen it all based off of his hair. Yeah, some people are inevitably gonna start cheering for him. He's a strong fighter, that's what these people want. That's, the, that's kind of what the theme was. I would bet money that there's more of them here now, more of the Blackbeard pirates. Unless he's here in Dressrosa all alone. Oh, the little soldier. Aw, he's grown to like a liking to Frankie. <laughs> stop, stop saying that so loudly, please, man. Frankie. Everybody's looking at him. Get out of there, guys. I wonder, uh, such a radical thing. I wonder why he has taken such a liking to Frankie, though. Ha Harudin. The missionary Gambia. Why is he freaking out? Wait, is that a navy phone? It looks like a navy phone. Isho son. Oh, goodness. Stavos or Pirate Group? The Bartow Club? Oh, interesting. The missionary. Oh, Gambia. Well, he has like like leopard looking things. He has like a cross across his chest. Kind of reminds me of the Whitebeard cross. I think these are undercover Navy officers like reporting. It seems like it. I guess it would make sense based off of Dovomingo just now retiring. Ooh. Ooh. You don't want any part of this, man. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. He cut him down! Oh my gosh. So it's more than them just spying. Hmm. Dude, who is this giant man? This insane blind swordsman. Oh, he's going with that guy. Wait, is he from the Navy? Oh. Wait. Oh no. He's gonna drag it down. Bro. Bro! God, he's just enormous. <gasps> he is Navy! Wait! Oh, shoot. What rank, though? He has to be really high ranks. how strong he is. Does it say? I can't read that! Three Navy ships. Oh, shoot. Not the docks. An admiral! Oh, they're going to Green Bay! Fujitora Isho. Oh, they did say Isho. <gasps> Oh, he replaced uh, Aokiji. Wait, there's still one missing slot then because Akainu is fleet admiral. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, there's an admiral. He no, that makes sense though, how strong he was. Ah. Is it necessary? Remember we have to protect. He's gonna go to Green Bit, where the the handoff is supposed to happen. Interesting perspective though. He has the he has a protection mentality, which I feel like is a good sign. 
Oh, shoot. So now the admirals are Kizaru and him, and there's still one missing spot, though. Unless they've already filled that, too, and they just haven't told us. Oh, shoot. They're kicking in the action. Well, maybe this guy's another admiral. Oh, Capman? He straight killed Gambia! Oh, wait, no, he's not dead. Just throw him in the trash. Oh, Vice Admiral. Okay, Maynard the Pursuer. Oh, shoot, it's getting juicier, man! Oh! He's being followed, too! What's happening in Dress Rosa? Oh, shoot. Isho. What a sick name. He's a cool admiral, too. I, I respect it. Oh, man, it's go time. <gasps> Is that him? Oh, my gosh. Let me see. He's way big. Oh, it's him. He knows it's Luffy. Oh, my gosh. Oh! And Luffy recognizes him right away. Wait, wait, what was the, what was the rest of his name? I, I I just remembered Isho. Man, what an introduction for him though. Fuji Tora. Okay, I don't know what to. I'll call him Isho probably. Nah, Fuji Tora is a signet. Fuji Tora. Oh my gosh, man! So an admiral is already here, has already taken notes. That's why whenever he saw Luffy, he knew. I think he knew who he was. Like he saw through the disguise, but chose not to reveal his hand yet. And that's why whenever he said he said. I won't tell you for both my sake and your sake. It's a big deal that he's here and he wants to, I think, be a little bit more methodical about what happens because we really don't know why exactly he's here. Since Doflamingo isn't protected by the Navy anymore, he he resigned. The Navy's kind of in between right now because there's sort of three parties. The Straw Hats, the Doflamingo, the Don Quixote family, and now the Navy. 635. Scene one. What is this? Oh, shoot. Dude, look at him. He's a freaking mammoth. He's way bigger. Oh, my gosh. Forever ago. Is it the same voice actor? It's been so long. His ability was really cool. The springs bounced all over the place. I mean, Luffy finished him in one hit, though. Yeah, one single punch. Makes Saitama proud. <laughs> Maro. Not even close, Luffy. The former captain of the Bellamy Pirates. Oh, shoot. 195 million bounty. God dang. It's been my pirate hero. I mean, isn't that Doflamingo's, like, insignia on his literal chest? No interest in... I mean, you can't take it. You already have a double fruit. Oh, shoot. A rematch? He's probably way stronger now. What? No way. Turn my view of the world upside down. Wait. That's what I was thinking. Like harass them or something. Oh my gosh. Wow. He actually went. The wild wave that will come sooner or later. What? Done picking on you. Uh, you couldn't pick on him even if you wanted to, little bro. That's interesting, though, that he said his world got turned upside down. Like, maybe he reassessed how he viewed the world. I think he means he's going to fight under Doflamingo, though. This is the one stalking the Vice Admiral. Ugh. Ugh. So many unique designs here at Dressrosa, though, I will say. Is that Caesar under... Oh, my gosh. There's no way. There is no way. Oh, my gosh. They all have mustaches. Ooh. That's the bridge to Green Bit. So Green Bit isn't just like a, uh, I guess, regular part of the island. That's why they're doing the handoff there. School of fighting fish inhabit the area. Fighting fish? The fact that Caesar is just sitting here, bro. Good question. Savage fish with horns. Oh, wait. Aren't those the ones in the Colosseum? Change the handing over spot. Yeah, they had to cross that dangerous bridge to get there. And everybody's fine with it. Yeah. I mean, life goes on, you know? I think it depends on if he, like, names a successor. Like, a, a king to replace him. Oh. Who is that? Uh, dude, there's no way there's more characters that I'm gonna have to remember. Oh my gosh, that is a tall mf -er, bro. What? CP0? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Cypher Pole Zero! They're the greatest. They're strong. The strongest Cypher Pole. 
Why are they here? Oh my god, everybody is in Dressrosa. What is happening, bro? Cypher pole zero? You're kidding. Oh, scene three, the fairy and Zoro. Okay. It's just kind of trying to keep track. I cannot believe Zoro is still chasing this thing. It has been like four episodes. He's right there. Come on, Zoro. It can't be that fast, man. At this point, you deserve to lose it. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. CP0. This is insanity. God, one of them was insane. I mean, two of them were really tall. <laughs> Caught it. Finally. Oh my gosh, man. Oh. Oh. I think we saw a glimpse of the fairy. Oh. The fairy fell too. This human will see me. Okay, so it's not human. Is Zora really the first to get close enough to be able to- Oh. He sees it. Stray Kinemon! Oh my gosh. And then Kinemon's just being stalked by someone. Oh, there's so many trails to follow. What? What is this, like, gang, bro? Oh yeah, that was the original guy following him with a mask. What? Is he getting jumped? What the hell? Isn't that a Tom not- Oh, shoot. They're spot on. So top not just automatically means you're from uh, Wano. Oh my gosh, you're so perceptive! Holy cow! Saw you in the vi oh, came looking for his friend, his fellow swordsman. I really like his sheath too. Oh, do they have Conjuro? I mean, obviously they know exactly what he's looking for, so I'm guessing they do have him or know where he is at the very least. What do they want? This gang is a lot more intimidating than I thought like at first because they look kind of goofy. I mean, you see a gang that big, you have to assume a lot of them are just cannon fodder. All right, time for round two. We didn't really see much of block A. Oh, so Bellamy's in B? Oh, I want to see Bellamy fight. I want to see how strong he's gotten. Oh, there's the Vice Admiral. I already forgot his name. Admiral is Isho. I can remember that. Dude, what is this guy? Navy-san. Oh, that was his subordinate? Is he a captain? Oh, Bartolomeo! We've heard about him. He was more one of the more uh, renowned. Yeah, in the in the tournament. Am I saying his name right? Bartolomeo? He looks kind of cool. He just looks a little goofy. His style's like all over the place. Like he picked one thing and then just completely swapped for the next in terms of his outfit, his look, everything. Scene five. My goodness gracious, them laying out like this makes me realize how many loose ends there are. I'm happy for Sanji. Honestly, just know this probably won't end well. Just, he's just, just fated not to. Oh, oh, there's a member of the gang. <laughs> just wanted to say her name. Dude, it's cute. Violet. Oi. Aw, dude, this is so adorable. Oh, bro. I was just waiting for it all to come crush crashing down. He's about to snipe. Oh my gosh, there's no way. There is no way. Damn! Yes, sir! He runs right up! Get his ass, Sanji! Attaboy! She's like... <laughs> Aww. Forgive me. How is the weather? Oh my gosh. For you, Violet. For you. Anybody can... <laughs> so was that technically hockey that allowed him to do that? Like, basically sense that sniper? Aww. It's like a real love, too. I would say this... Uh, seen, we haven't even seen Sunny since we got here. I would say it's the first true love for Sanji. It seems like it. I mean, I think he genuinely loves Robin and Nami, but you know what I mean. One that the show has, like, actually explored. Just the kiddos on the ship. Poison tester. Training him in his ways. I just wish Chopper has a cute little camo outfit. Chapaemon. A vas vassal? Chapaemon? A maid. Oh, no. Is this like a play? Oh, my gosh. Bro. Bro! So shameless. You heard me, Nami. Sleeping in your lap, Barty. Oh, my gosh. 
Chopper's so cute. Oh, I mean, he's just a little kid. Chopper's very empathetic towards kids. I think because he's probably like one of the youngest on the crew. He is basically a kid. So he kind of understands some kind of trauma. I mean, it seems like it. Aww. So did Momonosuke say he's supposed to be Shogun? I feel like he's like, if he's actually like higher up, like, I, I don't know if it'd be like royalty in Wano, but oh my gosh, the thrower bark zombies. It would be surprising for him to be like out of the house, or, like out, off of Wano or off the island. Cause it, it seems like he would be important in that sense. Either that or he just likes playing Shogun. But I swear he said he was supposed to be or something like that. Who's on the ship? Wait, who, who else is on the ship? I forgot. Oh, it was supposed to be Sanji, but he's not here. Who's that then? Someone's just breaking stuff in the kitchen? Oh my gosh, bro. I don't recognize the voice. Chopper's got a gun! <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. My goodness. Oh my gosh. The, the hand. Molinosuke kind of acts like a spoiled kid, like sort of like royalty. Oh. Oh my gosh. What is happening in there? What is that? <laughs> it almost seems like a devil fruit. Like a hallucinogen. What? What is happening on Sunny? Oh, shoot. Wait. Bartolomeo is no joke. He actually roughed up this vice admiral? <laughs> Without breaking a sweat either? Oh my gosh. Can I just call him Barto? You see his devil fruit? He's no joke for sure. Bar yeah, I'm gonna call him Barto. Can I call him Bart? Oh, I'm gonna call him Bart. I think he just killed that Navy officer. He put him in the trash. Oh, shoot. Did to him what he did to his subordinate. Dang, bro. Bart is no joke. Meanwhile. <laughs> sure, dude. You're a bit of a, a pompous dick, but you can watch with us. Oh, Bart's going in. Oh, yeah. He did say he was in B. Took him a year to become infamous. He's got to be pretty strong. He has a blade in his front. Roasted pirates on a skewer and shared the video. He's a live leak poster? Number one, the most annoying pirate who should just go away. I mean, it's, okay. Bartolo Bartolomeo. I think that's how you say it. Bartolomeo. I don't know, bro. We've had more uh, interactions with Cavendish, but Cavendish honestly seems more, like, annoying than Bart so far. But, I mean, like I said, that's because we've had more interactions with him. But a lot of big reveals, mostly being that that, that Admiral is here. CP0 is here. That's huge. And then whatever's happening on Sunny, I really don't know. The fact that someone is ever on the Sunny that isn't a straw hat or isn't, like, I guess, authorized to be here, I feel like is always a big deal. Just because, like, A, how did you get here? And B, what, what are you doing here? And as I said, uh, uh, Dress Rosa just continues to deliver the conversation between Luffy and Bellamy. Seeing that Bellamy actually, the one that dis disregarded Skypea as existing the most, found himself there. But he seems to still be that sort of, it's not like he's like completely turned a new leaf and like follows what Luffy sort of said. He still seems to be pretty like relatively evil. Instead, he's pretty much submitted himself to being under Doflamingo's command. I forget what he said, like the wild wave or something. I'm guessing he's just saying if things get rough or if like war breaks out to any extent, he'll be basically with Doflamingo, wherever Doflamingo is. He still looks up to him, very obviously. But I mean, the fact that he's even alive is just a shocker in and of itself. But guys, that has been it for my reaction today. I hope you did enjoy. Make sure you leave a like on this one if you have not already. It helps me out quite a bit. And I will catch you next time. Peace, peace.